Hey everyone, thanks for joining me. My name is Dakota and on this channel we have fun with learning and creating art. Let's see what we're creating today. Okay, so for our super easy uh, Valentine's Day card, the supplies we are using is Arches watercolor paper. It's a 9 by 12 but I cut it down into fours. Tape, a pencil, Windsor Newton Cotman watercolor set, two cups of water, paper towel, um, I'm going to be using a size 8 round brush, we've got uh, Windsor Newton uh, masking fluid, and I've just got a cheap brush to use with the masking fluid. Okay, so to start, I'm going to use the pencil to lightly draw in a heart in the center that we're going to fill with the masking fluid. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use my eraser to lightly erase, um, but I still want to see some of the line through. Okay, so now I'm going to use the masking fluid. Okay. And I'm just going to fill in the heart. Okay, so now we have to let that dry, and I'm going to go rinse off this brush, even though it's cheap, I'd like to use it again, and if I leave the masking fluid on here, it will just harden on the bristles and wreck it. Alright, so while the masking fluid is drying, I'm going to choose the colors that I want to use. So, uh, the first color is going to be the permanent rose. Second color, purple. Now I've got purple lake and deoxazine purple. I think I want deoxazine purple. It's a lot darker. I think it goes really well with the pink. Now I may end up actually diluting it, that's a bit too much. Make it a little bit lighter, we'll see. Um, maybe On a little bit of red. Let's see. Yeah, I like that. I think we're just going to use these three colors. Um, and that red was the cadmium red deep hue. So we've got the permanent rose, deoxazine purple, and the cadmium red deep hue that we'll use. So again, we have to wait for the masking fluid to completely dry before we can paint over it. So we'll come back when that's done. 
All right, so now the masking fluid is completely dry. I'm going to use some clear water and I'm just gonna wet the, the whole page here. Um, not soaking wet, but enough to make the paint bleed into each other nicely. Okay, so now I'm just going to add some water to my paints here. So we've got permanent rose. Deoxazine purple. And again, I want the purple a little bit lighter. And then we'll have the cadmium red. Deep hue. Okay, so let's see. Let's start with the pink. And then I'm just going in and Dabbing it in. Let's get some purple. It's okay if you see some of the white through. I actually like that marbling effect. Um, I think it really adds to it, which is nice. So now I want to just let this dry and um, see how it looks. Um, you can always add a second layer or leave it as is. So that's what I want to do is just leave it and see if uh, if I need to add a second layer or not. So again, just gonna wait for it to dry completely. I've got two Posca pens. I've got a gold and a silver for writing inside the heart. I'm not sure which one I want to use. I think the gold is just too too strong. Maybe I'll use the silver. Okay, so let's get this masking fluid off. So I'm just gonna use my finger and just lightly um, brush on the masking fluid. Just gently, I just wanna lift the masking fluid, not wreck the paper or the paint. that's off. Now I'm going to use my pencil to write in first and then go over it with the Posca markers, uh, pens, whatever you call them, or pen markers, paint markers. Um, so you can write anything you want in here. Um, have a 
your Valentine's Day. Be mine. Will you be my Valentine? I love you. And that's actually what I think I'm going to write is I love you. Just trying to determine how I want to do it. Now these are a little bit thicker, so they're not thin pointed. So I have to make sure that it's bigger writing and I leave enough room. So I can always do I love you hmm let's try it something like that um all right, i'm just gonna erase it so i can still see the lines just not as much and then hopefully with the posca pens over top you won't be able to see it okay i wanted to do the silver always outline in the gold. I don't know how that will look. You know what? Let's just do it. You can outline in any color. You can leave it the way it is. Do it in black. Red. Turn this. There we go. Like that. Okay. Okay, I'm going to peel the tape now. Okay, so there it is. Super easy, super relaxing, fun. You just do what you want. Um, I think if I were to change it, I, I would change the way I did the writing. Um, I don't really like the empty white spacing here. Um, I may, you know, even painting in the heart with a different color. Um, so that it's not so white or maybe using a different color for the writing. Um, Either way, I still like it. It's nice Valentine's card um, or even anniversary. That would work too. Again, you can choose whatever saying you want to write in it. You don't even have to write anything in it. You can just have a different colored heart or just leave it white. Um, you could do little hearts on the inside, whatever you want. Um, so there we go.
a nice Valentine's card, or like I said, you can use it for anniversary. Um, great for beginners and children, super easy to do, and um, not much materials, not much time to complete it. So I really hope you enjoyed this video, um, and I hope you try it and have some fun with it. Thanks so much. Thanks again for joining me. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to like and subscribe for more, and I hope to see you next time.